A very good morning to Megan and my fellow friends. Today, we will want to present our group project, which is the title is about the accommodation problems in university. And my name is Taki Jia, my matrix number is 263368. So as we know that accommodation is very important to all university students, However, the problem in every student is facing is limited accommodation due to the population of the new impact students is increasing year by year. This affecting some of the students do not have hostel to stay when the school reopened. Every student hopes to stay in a hostel which provided by university and this is based on their merit mark which they accumulated throughout the previous year, which means that the more the, the more the student participate the activities, the more merits they get. However, the problem is there are some students with high merits who are also not accepted to stay in the hostel. So there are some solutions that we have recommended. The first one is <coughs> a host, the hostel management need to update the computer system in the office is because the student check-in check-out room is recorded all in the system and we have find that after the student have complained to the office about they don't have hostel to stay they found that there are some students who don't have roommate means that some of the room are not fully stayed After that, we hope that staff in charge in, in charge in this department need to make sure the system is correctly key in. With this, they will not miss up any available room for the students who do not have cost down to stay. And the second solution is the sing we can try to change the single bed to the type of the double decker bed. It's because the type of double decker bed can fit in four students in each room. With this solution, this solution can lower the budget compared with build more hostel. By changing the type of the bed from the single bed to the double decker bed, the capacity of the student to fit in the room will increase and without wasting the time and more money. Okay. Uh, my name is Sigurd Mitri Mitra and my criteria number is 264 Okay, the next recommended solution is increasing the number of step. As we all know, the number of step in the UAM can fit to 1000 per step. Except for hostel in the Bukit Gaji, for in a CSPR, they can fit until 2000 students in the hostel and also in a CSME. Four. So, next, uh, the point is here we can put more in a CIS because based on the land in the end, you can see that there are so many empty land, and we, I think that EM system management can put one more in a CIS because based on, based on this idea, the the hotel hostel management can fit the the amount of student UAM into the hostel management about three to four thousand more students. And next is the UAM hostel management should be more focused on undergraduate students because most of the programs were handled by the students. And as we can see here, uh, there are many and majority of postgraduate students in the UAM for such as master's student and for those who are taking PhD they are not involved they are not involving involving themselves in joining the in joining the program that were entered by the university. Next as we can see that these students are so are very focusing on building the program, creating the program for the students but it is not fair because the postgraduate students just can relax on their room, in their room and doing nothing. So we can change the in a CIS Marriott, sorry, in a CIS Maybank to undergraduate students because it can fix more 
more degraded experience in about 1,000 students. Next, these postgraduate students can move to Dama University located in the Sinto and the Jitra. Okay, next, uh, I will continue with uh, description. Uh, Matrix number is uh, before that, uh, my name is Muhammad Sharif Nabi Mufti. My metric number is 2583. Okay, I'll continue with a uh, description of concept. Okay, this question of concept is about that uh, operation is vital is, uh, to all university students, which is uh, undergraduate and postgraduate students at the university. So, accuracy is based on for students in university residential halls are safe, comfortable, and good value and also uh, they also change opinion with the other students. So the next, uh, the UEF uh, is living in hostel much more cheaper than the outsider. So, <clears throat> so one point of number one is I will take on for the recommendation. I just explain a little bit about the recommended. recommended. Okay, for the first one is the uh, hotel management should be focusing on undergraduate student because we all know that undergraduate student is more than uh, postgraduate student. So uh, hotel management should more focusing on the undergraduate student. And for the second one is uh, UM hostel management should be increase uh, the number of hostel. So so they must discuss with the uh, UUM's uh, treasure to take uh, a little bit fun with them to build for another building to make uh, more to make more space for the student undergraduate undergraduate to live in there. And for the last one is uh, time management should change the single bedroom to the double bedroom because we are, we all know that currently uh, for one room uh, two people are there. So just imagine one room uh, reaching to double liquor, which is four bedrooms. So we have four people in one room. So it will, uh, can be uh, fit. So your student can get their own accommodation in this UEM. So, uh, my name is Vizikia. My metric number is 262192. So I, uh, I will say about the analysis of concept. So the first one is build new hostel. Uh, as we know, UUM is had quite big space, big big empty space to build a uh, new hostel. But and it can increase the huge number of room and uh, students can live inside the hostel. But the this advantage is it too high cost to build a new hostel. Next is change the two single bed into two double decker bed. For now, uh, one room can fit two people. But if we change to double decker, one room can fit four people. So uh, then the advantage for this this solution is low cost, but the old bed is wasted. Next, the SSC should always update room information. It's a quite way to solve this, this problem, but staff need to key in many data before semester break and after semester break. Next is turn in access Maybank into hostel for undergraduate students. As we know, uh, Maybank now is for the student have family stay inside. The advantage is it does not require a lot of money. But we need to renovate the hostel because the structure for Maybank is for Inasis Maybank is not same like others hostel. Next is renovate storeroom become hostel. Every level has minimum three storeroom. Uh, for this this storeroom is normally for during the semester break, students put their belongings into the for this advantage is not need to pay and buy double 
be better on this. But students don't have place to keep their belonging during the semester break. The last one is not allow students to stay one person in a room, although they share double rentals. Some of the students will require using one room, but they are, they are paying for two person fees. But student for this soli uh, solution, many more students can have hostel to stay, but students will quarrel with roommate if their lifestyle is not safe. For example, some of the students will study at midnight, but some of the students will sleep early, so that's my part. Hi, my name is Leela, Leela Nair, daughter of Sridhar. Now I'm going to talk about the conclusion of our project. Accommodation is very important for everyone in daily life, whereas accommodation is a place where we can stay. Accommodation play a vital role in student life. Recently at UUM, recently at UUM, there is an issue that students didn't get chance to stay at at hostel even though they have higher merit. Nowadays, nowadays students enter UUM is increasing by year by year. There are some there are some students didn't get hostel to stay even though they have paid for the accommodation fee. It is because of uh, it is because of the new index students. In nutshell, UEM should not promise to students that they can stay in UEM for four years. It is because the students are coming far away from their home to study at UEM and the parents will feel that the children is unsecure if they are staying they are staying outside of the UEM. The UEM management should The UN management should take this issue as a serious matter and should avoid students staying outside of the UN. Thank you. So this is the appendix we use uh, during our report. Okay, okay that's all from us.